Well, hello, today we are gonna talk about vitamin D in relationship to your immune system. First thing you need to know is that vitamin D is intimately connected to every single immune reaction. In fact, the white blood cells have the ability to make vitamin D active. Vitamin D helps in killing viruses effectively. So in fact, vitamin D is very important. In fact, viruses has one of their strategies to downgrade a turn of the vitamin D receptors. So you can't get any more vitamin D. Vitamin D deficiencies occur when there's not enough sunlight in the winter. The spike of liver and other viral infections is because the vitamin D is low in fact in the pandemic of 1918, a Spanish flu, it peaked in January. Now another thing that's interesting about the winter months are basically between November and March we have much higher incidence of autoimmune diseases. Vitamin D deficiencies can cause number one lupus MS type 1 diabetes mellitus. Number two it can cause a rheumatoid arthritis. Number three it can cause irritable bowel disease why because vitamin d is a natural kind of steroid anti-inflammatory and so it has a key function in reducing inflammation when you have an autoimmune disease the thing that really creates the damage is the inflammatory process so if you have enough vitamin d you can't have a lot less inflammation. Inflammation causes damage to our body tissues. Vitamin D is an immunomodulator. Okay, what does that mean immunomodulator? It means that it helps to normalize something that is too much or too little. So it brings into a normal range. In short, you need vitamin D. It helps in lower the risk of infections. These are the foods rich in vitamin D. Foods that provide vitamin D include fatty fish like tuna, mackerel and salmon. Foods fortified with vitamin D like some dairy products, orange juice, soy milk and cereals, beef flavor, cheese, egg yolks. It's virtually impossible to get your vitamin D from your food needed to get from Sam directly. I during the winter months take it as a supplement in the form of pills tablets. Thanks for watching. If you really enjoyed or gained something from this video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe.